Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. So in today's video, I thought I would share with you guys some of my top nude lipsticks that I have in my collection. I'm going to be sharing with you guys my high-end favorites as well as my low-end favorites. Um, recently, I mentioned this in a previous video um, that my love for nude lipsticks has resurfaced. For a while, I kind of stayed away from them. I was more into wearing like mauve tones and more like darker neutrals, but I don't know, something in me is re-inspired and is loving nude lipsticks again. So I thought I would share some of my favorites with you guys. So in today's video, I'm going to be um, showing you my favorite lipsticks as well as my favorite lip combos when it comes to wearing a nude lip. So if you guys are interested in seeing that, then please keep on watching. So since I already did my makeup and I'm wearing a high-end lipstick, I think I'm going to start off on the high-end side and then I'll do the um, more affordable drugstore lipsticks at the very end. So right now what I'm wearing is I'm wearing the um, lip, liquid lipstick by Kylie Jenner in the shade Exposed. So to, against my skin tone, it's a very nice peachy nude. So that's what I have on today. And to line my lips, I used the e.l.f. and the Bella Noir lip liner in my Renewed. Now I did get this in a um, lip kit a couple years ago, so I do have the lip liner. So um, that works as well, but I just couldn't find it today, so I paired it with this guy. And so yeah, this is the first nude lipstick that I'm obsessed with. So the next lipstick, um, high-end nude lipstick that I love is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Matte Lipstick in Honey. So I'll just show you guys what it looks like. And what I love to do is I love to pair this lipstick with the e.l.f. and Abella Noir lip liner in my Renewed. Um, honestly, any neutral uh, mauve lip liner, kind of like this one, will look really good with any nude lipstick. So I'm going to go ahead in and put this on. Alright, so this is the lip combo applied. Um, I love this one. I feel like this one is a peachy nude, but it's definitely not as peachy as Kylie Cosmetics Exposed. Um, I love this one for like an everyday nude lip. Um, so yeah, this is the next lip combo. Alright, so my next favorite nude lip combo on the high-end side is the Huda Beauty um, Power Bullet Lipstick in the shade Anniversary and I love pairing the MAC Lip Liner Whirl with it. So I'll show you guys the lipstick. And the lip liner. And what I'm doing is I'm just filling in these sides of my lips. So this is the um, lipstick and the lip liner applied. Um, you can see that this one is more of a pinky nude um, type of color and that's why I love pairing it with the MAC World lipstick. I feel like they're just a perfect combination. So yeah, this is the next high-end lip combo that I'm obsessed with. 
Alright, so the next lipstick is my Kat Von D Bow and Arrow Matte Lipstick. Now they do have this in a liquid lipstick version, but I find that the liquid lipstick version isn't as nude. It's more of a darker mauve color, so that's why I really like the um, matte lipstick. It's very nice and it's a very nude lipstick on me. It's more of a muted, cool toned nude, and I love pairing it with my Nivella Noir and e.l.f. Cosmetics lip liner. So I'm going to go ahead and and apply these. Alright, so this is the lipstick applied, the lipstick and the lip liner, and I'm obsessed with this one. This is definitely um, more of a darker nude, and it's a cool tone nude, and I love that about this. Um, some of you might consider this to be too dark to be a nude, but in my opinion, I consider this a nude, and so if you are someone who is maybe a little darker than me, then this might be like a true nude for you, and if you're someone who's lighter, then this will probably just look like a very nice mauve cool toned lipstick. So this is the next one. Alright, so the next high-end lipstick that I'm obsessed with is my MAC Matte Lipstick in Yash. And I love pairing this with, again, the Elf and Novella Noir Lip Liner in my Renewed. Alright, so this is Yash as well as the lip liner applied. I'm obsessed with this one. I think this is one of my top, top favorites in my collection. I feel like this has all the perfect tones in it to really suit my complexion. It's got peachy tones but also pink tones. I feel like it's the perfect nude for me. So I'm obsessed with this one. My lips hurt so much guys, you don't even know. Alright, so the last high-end lipstick that I'm obsessed with and I'm so excited to share with you guys is my Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in Carmelo. This is a very nice purpley toned, pinky toned nude lipstick. I love it. Um, I recently came across it in my collection. Um, if you guys check out my recent Daisy makeup tutorial, I used this in that tutorial and I'm obsessed with it. It's so beautiful and I'm really, really excited to wear it this summer. Um, and obviously hopefully this spring um, when things start to get a little normal um, just a side note again I really hope that you guys are all doing okay and that you guys are safe I know it's very scary times right now but that's why I'm just making videos trying to stay positive trying to keep you guys entertained um, so yeah again hope you guys are doing okay so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and, and apply this and I'm gonna pair it with again the <laughs> Nivella Noir and Elf Cosmetics lip liner in my Rit nude and this is the exact same combo that I wore in that tutorial and I fell in love. It's so beautiful. So I'm going to go ahead and put these on. Alright you guys, so this is the final high-end nude lipstick that I'm obsessed with. You can see that it's a very pinky nude lipstick. It's almost like purpley too in my opinion. I think that's because it's like 
cool toned um, but anyways if you guys like this lipstick and you want to see a tutorial on how you can wear this lipstick then make sure to check out my recent Daisy get ready with me tutorial I'll have it linked down below in the description so now I guess I will move on to the more uh, lower end affordable drugstore nude lipsticks that I'm obsessed with Alright, so the first affordable nude lipstick that I want to share with you guys is this lipstick by Maybelline. It is called Truffle Tease 930. I believe this is a matte lipstick, I think. I don't remember, but we'll see once I put it on. But I just know that I was obsessed with this back in the day. Um, this was my like everyday lipstick for high school. So I'm really excited to put this on. It's been a while. But I remember this was like a perfect nude for my skin tone. So I'm going to go ahead in and put this on. So this is definitely not a matte lipstick, it's got like a shine to it, um, but it's still a beautiful nude and you can see that it works well with my skin tone. I'm just going to go ahead in with the e.l.f. and Nabella Noir lip liner and I'm just going to line my lips a little bit. Alright guys, so this is the lipstick applied. Um, it's definitely not a matte lipstick. You can see there is a shine to it, but nonetheless, it's such a beautiful nude and it looks very great against my skin tone and I feel like it can look really good against um, other skin tones as well. Like I mentioned, playing it up with different lip liners and different lipsticks to make it work um so yeah i love this one this was like my go-to lipstick in high school and i'm honestly like reminiscing those days as i put this lipstick on um so yeah this is the more affordable nude lipstick that i'm obsessed with so the last three lipsticks that I have to share with you guys are all NYX lipsticks and they're very affordable. So I'll start with the first one and it is the Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Stockholm. And I'm going to be pairing this with my World Lip Liner by MAC. So this is Stockholm, you guys. I know it looks like a very pink lipstick, but to me, I feel like it looks more on the nude side. Um, again, if you are lighter than me, then this is definitely not a nude for you. Um, but if you're darker, then it might look more of a true nude on you. Um, I don't know. To me, I always kind of considered this lipstick in my collection a nude. Um, so yeah, this is Stockholm by NYX. I love it so much. So next I have this NYX lipstick in the shade London and I'm going to be pairing this with my Nivella Noir and ALF lip liner. Alright, so this is London. This is definitely more of a peachy nude. Um, I really, really like this one. I love pairing this um, with a lot of like darker lipsticks. I'll just top this off in the center to create like an ombre and it looks so nice. So yeah, this is another perfect nude affordable lipstick that I'm obsessed with and I feel like would look really great on many other uh, brown skinned girls. And the last lipstick that I have is this NYX Strictly Vinyl um, lipstick and this is actually a gloss. So I'm going to go ahead in and put this on. All 
Alright guys, so this is the last lipstick that I wanted to share with you guys and this is again the NYX Strictly Vinyl in Sugar Mama and this is a gloss as you can see. Alright guys, so this is the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed um, getting to know what my current favorite nude lipsticks are in terms of high end and in terms of low end and hopefully you guys are inspired to try out some new lipsticks and new lipstick combos. If you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see similar videos like this where I talk about my favorites and what I have in my collection that I really recommend to you guys, then make sure to subscribe subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up and of course hit that notification bell so you are notified every time I post a new video and of course all the products that I discussed today and talked to you guys about will be listed down below in the description box so make sure to check that out and if you have any suggestions on videos that you would like me to do then again make sure to comment down below and let me know and I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.